So which one of these fractions is larger? Three-fifths or three-eighths? Well, you could maybe reason it out, or on a calculator, you could divide three by five, get a decimal, divide three by eight, get a decimal, and compare them. See if three-fifths is larger or smaller than three-eighths. We could also find a common denominator, because if the denominator is the same, we just compare the numerators, and we'll know. So let's take and say five times eight, because five times eight, that equals 40. And then down here, eight times five, that equals 40. And so now we have the same denominator. But we can't just multiply the denominator. We have to multiply the numerator too. So 8 times 5 and then 3 times 5. Because that's the way we have 5 over 5. That just equals 1. And we're multiplying by 1. We don't change the value just the way it's represented. Up here we'll multiply by 8. 3 times 8 is 24. Down here 3 times 5 is 15. Same denominator. We can see that 24, that's greater than 15. So 24 fortieths is greater than 15 fortieths. Since these here are equivalent, 3 fifths, that's larger than 3 eighths. And we can tell by how much. 24 minus 15 is 9. So it's 9 fortieths larger. 3 fifths is 9 fortieths larger than 3 eighths. Kind of nice. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.